The Olympics are here, which means it's time for the International Shootout Challenge. Now, I'm not going to lie. I thought this was going to be a happy video celebrating our countries that we represent in the Olympics. But unfortunately, today it is quite sad. Late last night in men's hockey, Team USA was eliminated. We took on Slovakia, went to a shootout of all things, and they took the big L. Not only that, but just minutes ago this morning, Team Canada also took a big L, which means both Canada and USA are not advancing. I said it before the game, and I'll say it now. The shootout has no place in the Olympics. Not in the elimination games, not in the medal games. We just cannot be having it. Good news is tonight, we still have USA versus Canada in the women's gold medal game. That's going to be electric. And of course, today, despite our hatred for shootouts, we are doing another shootout challenge. And this is one of my favorites. You guys know the drill by now. We're hopping into two random online shootouts and using two random international teams. We will use any team. So we could get Great Britain. We could get USA, Canada, Russia, Sweden, whatever it is we have to use them for today's video we're gonna have two packs on the line and we do have the big nations of hockey packs out right now with some 95 overalls that we can pull so we got two of these one for game one one for game two a 28 percent chance at an 86 plus and here's hoping today is the day our luck changes Here's some of the 95 overalls we could pull right now. That 95 overall, Zach Wierenski looking clean. So that is what we are hoping to get. Let's hop in to shootout number one. This right here is the most important part of the video, and that is when we pick our random team. Now, they do not have the current Olympic rosters in the game, so we do still have the stacked lineups with the NHL players included. Obviously, we're hoping for USA or Canada, but whatever we get, we have to use, and that is part of the challenge. Here we go. Team number one in three, two one and we got team korea yo the jerseys low-key looking clean though i had not seen these korean jerseys i actually really like the look of those all right so we're rocking with team korea for uh shootout number one please wish me the best i i didn't know who we were gonna be playing against i was not expecting to play against an nhl team here off the rip but yes it is going to be korea versus the chicago i gotta i gotta remember i cannot dig too much in this one let's go baby hey nice and clean again with this international shootout challenge using these players we have to play it simple all right we're just gonna walk in go nice little forehand backhand no dot suits no dot suits flips no michigan attempts let's just keep it clean dude i'm telling you we cannot lose in these jerseys Team Korea low-key looking clean. Especially the white jerseys are even filthier than the blues. These are sick. I would like to clarify before we get into this video, before we get too far in, I've got nothing but respect for all... Oh, off the post! I have nothing but respect for all of the teams worldwide. I love that more countries are getting involved with hockey. The overalls, yes, they may be a little bit low with Team Korea. But listen, they're out here grinding. They got a team put together. You love to see the game of hockey grow. That is what it's all about. Unfortunately, we did get buried there by Patrick Kane, but that's okay. No way we lose this game. Little jump deke. You were just going to do deeks that I know. Ew. I mean, that's clean. Park coming through with a little Kyle Turris. Brings it around. Holds it to that forehand. I knew he was going to get a little aggressive. Fleury was sitting at the top of his crease, trying to wait it out, but not today. Also, can we talk about Fleury? I heard some rumblings. I don't know if they were true or not. I got to look into it. I got to look into it some more. There were some rumblings that Fleury may go back to the Vegas Golden Knights. I feel like there's no shot in a million years that that man lets that happen with how they treated him. But if it... I'm going to try it out too. Dude, Team Korea is gross! I, I need the dog too. It used to be every single year we do this challenge. And it used to be any time you try to do any deep, whether you try to go between the legs or try a dog soup with these lower overall players, they just drop it. But no, Team Korea, I'm telling you, we are a team. We're a team on a mission. Unfortunately, our goaltender, not so much on a mission. As we slide, every time you hit that right analog stick, you just slide so far over and there's no coming back from it. But we do have a chance to win this thing with Team Korea. Let's get it. Here we go. We're going to go jump deke. I'm going to try. We just kicked it to ourselves. I'm going to try stand still toe drag. That, that's on me. I stopped a little bit too long. I was going to wait for him to come out for his classic poke check and hit him with the toey. Let's see if we can stay alive. Fake fly. Okay gonna be a battle here it is going to be a battle i had to commit to one side or the other again a little bit slow on the reflexes 
We had to commit to a side. We did, and we failed. All right, we got so coming in. We're going to go all the way. Listen, we're going we're gonna to cut all the way across. Yes. Put on the brakes. And he goes into the... Why does he go into the, the flying pad stacker just like that? Are you kidding? Not like this. The fly. Let's go. And oh, my Centrals get wrecked. This man just turned into a Beyblade on his head. What was that? Little... Let's go, baby. Let's go. Nice and clean. All we need is one save. One save. And we have one with Team Korea. Let's go. It all comes down to this. The fake fly. I mean, I'm in the best position that I can be in. You know, we hit him with the fake fly. We then back up, follow him into our crease, try to slide over to that side. It's just a little too late. All right, as we get lower in the roster, we do have to keep in mind the Deeks. Oh my gosh. I thought if I held it for an extra second, he was gonna spin and it was gonna open up. And just like this, the game on the line. What a save! What a save! The puck sit on the goal line. I thought I was gonna back myself into it, but we do not. What a battle this is! Cho coming in! He saves it on the goal line too! No! Oh my, dude, this is insane. The back and forth. Big fly! Are you, are you kidding? Are you this man, this man tries to do a toe drag, misses the toe drag completely, and just bodies me right into the net. And of course, no call from the referee. Watch this replay. He just straight skates in a straight line directly into me. How am I supposed to make that save? Especially with a 40 overall goaltender. Are you out of your mind? Multiple chances to win it. Multiple chances to make the save to win it. And unfortunately, we fall here in shootout number one. Team Korea. I'm not going to lie. It's tough not being able to do the deeks that I want to do. Credit where credit is due. That's a good team nasty jerseys we will bounce back from this that's a loss for number one a discard for pack number one but we will come back stronger the vibes were good we started off hot but we did not get the job done that's okay we do it here game number two team number two in three two one and there it is that is what we were looking for we had potential of getting two back-to-back -back bad teams we do not today, all right? USA, we got Matthews, we got Kaner, we got some of the best shootout guys in the world. There is no way that we are losing this game. All right, it is game number two. And no, it is not USA versus Canada, but it's kind of close. We got the USA versus the Maple Leafs, and it is going to be an absolute battle. Now, okay, right off the rip, this guy, this guy does a spin move and fires a puck right into Hellbuck's glove. We take those. Oh, we got Jack Eichel on here as well, who is making... <laughs> what was that? That's exactly what the guy did to me when I was using Team Korea. You just walk in, you fail at a toe drag, and you slam it into the net. And Jack Eichel does just that. Jack Eichel making his return tonight with the Golden Knights. Gonna be an absolute banger. Oh my gosh. What just happened? The whole game froze as this man did the chip deke. And then as it freezes, it goes under my pads. I mean, I probably should have just sat in my butterfly and let it come to me. Maybe that was on me, but the timing of the freeze was, was very interesting. <laughs> Austin Matthews with a filthy Nazi flip. I love when you hit LT just to get that little bit of a spin, then go right into the dot soup clip, messes up the goalie, makes it look nasty, and Austin Matthews gets it done. Now, we do have Austin Matthews that we have to save on the other side as well, and he tries to get a little too fancy. Let's go, Hellbuck. Let's go, baby. Dude, speaking of Team USA, can we talk about how Matty Beneers did not go once in the shootout yesterday? Potentially... Oh my, that's one of the cleanest goalies 
that I have ever seen. And we bury it top shelf on the backhand. Patty Kane, let's go. But yeah, Team USA, they got all these skilled, creative young guys. And Matty Beneers does not even get to attempt a shootout. I mean, Team USA doesn't score once in the shootout. They're eliminated from the Olympics just like that. Absolutely brutal. Also, brutal goaltending by Hellebuck. That one's on me, though. All right, what are we going to do here? I'm going to go behind the back. We've only scored nasty goals. I'm going to go fake between the legs. If, if that would have went in, this would have been the greatest shootout of all time. I hit it off the side of the net. I think I just waited a bit too long on that one. Now the question is, what do we do here? I'm going to go flying poke. Let's go! And just like that, Team USA, probably one of our best shootouts ever in terms of the goals that we scored. I, I'm telling you, if Johnny Hockey managed to pull that one off, it would have 100% been. But one of our better shootouts of the entire year, we get the job done with Team USA when they could not do it in real life. And we are going to get to keep that second pack. So first pack, discarded with Team Korea. Second pack, we get the W. We're keeping that one. We just got to hope all of our luck is in pack number two. All right, here we are. Nations of Hockey. Two packs. One we have to discard, one we have to keep. If we lose something good in this first pack, I'm never going to live it down. I think we need to start putting like a little counter in the screen on these videos for how long it's been since we have had a good pull because it feels like it has been a very long time. Well, let's get into pack number one. Of course, this is the one that we have to discard. So for the first time, well, not for the first time, we actually do this quite often. We are hoping that we don't get anything good in pack number one. It's all legit here. Like, if I pull a 95 overall, you guys know. I will put that card up for 1,000 coins, and somebody out there will find the card, buy it up, and get to keep it for themselves. There's T Tyler Toffoli. Just got his first goal with the Calgary Flames. Unfortunately, it was a bit of a nasty one versus my Columbus Blue Jackets. Nasty little flip. Nasty little finish. As we keep this one rolling, honestly, so far, so good. Unless we have some magic at the end of the pack in three, two, one. And we do not. So pack number one. I mean, this is... I think this is the worst possible pack. Yeah, and no, aside from the 82 overall stall, this is the worst possible pack that we could have gotten given the odds. So an absolute yikes to get things started. The good news is we have nothing to discard and we will go ahead and get into pack number two. Please, just one time and one time only. Listen, we've had a bit of a rough week. Team USA, gone. Team Canada, gone. It's time to turn our luck around. Last pack everything on the line again this is a tradable pack as well which is the good news so even if we get a player that doesn't quite fit into our lineup we can still toss them on the market get some coins and pick and of course we get a petrangelo who has a 95 overall card we get the 83 version that is how it always goes i think this has been two or three videos in a row where we've gotten the master item unfortunately we got the base version of the master item let's keep this rolling here as our luck is running out we do still have a couple 81 overall guaranteed at the end so that is the good news will there be a little bit of luck josh morrissey 82 nothing doing there two cards left last card who is buying these packs dude i mean there's not a single good card in here are you kidding 20 dollars worth of packs and we walk away with an 83 overall base card that we could barely sell for more than quick sell i i feel like i have to open up one more you guys want to see one more i'm opening up one more dude let's go you know what is this multi-league pack 70k coins do we do a 70k Am I just going to throw away the remainder of my coins? Yes, I am. All right. I'm not giving EA another dollar until we pull something good here. All right. We mean business. Last pack. We're trying out something new. We're going with coins. I'm throwing away 70K coins. We already threw away. Yeah. You know what? Not bad. Not, I mean, not great. Don't get me wrong. Not great. But not bad. Our boy Oscar Sunquist, 85 overall. A nice looking card too. You got to give credit where credit is due. But unfortunately, we need something bigger. All right. 85 overall confirmed. So the luck is starting to shift a little bit. Will there be something else in this one? I don't remember what the guarantees were. I think we have at least four guaranteed 81 or 82 overalls. And so far, we only have two. So you got to think there's going to be at least something 
There's Lindholm. There's one of them. There should be one more at the end. You would have. And just like that, three packs, 70K coins, $20, and we get one 85 overall to go with it. Oscar, appreciate you, brother. At least we do get to, to have you in our collection, but that's just not enough. Another rough pack opening for the boys. You just hate to see it. So that is unfortunately going to do it for this one. We can add a little number to our list of not pulling anything good, but we had a sick shootout nonetheless. Some nasty goals, some big wins, and we had some fun with Team Korea as well. I just want to wish all of the remaining teams in the Olympics the best of luck. USA versus Canada women's hockey going down tonight. That is going to be a banger. Best of luck to all the athletes going forward. Uh, if you guys did enjoy the video, you know what to do. Hit it with the like. Hit that subscribe button. We are on the road to 1 million subscribers. I'm Nasher, and I'm out. Peace.